What's good, y'all? Real quick before we get into the video, I just want to let you guys know that if you are not a part of the Patreon family, you are missing out. Patreon family members get early access to all videos, gaming videos, reaction videos, exclusive content, behind the scenes and bloopers. So if you are interested in that type of content or you just want to support me as a creator, join the Patreon family today and join the community because we are for real lit over there. I'm excited. I just dropped the little Nightmares gameplays over there. We're going to be dropping GTA, probably some Apex, maybe some Fortnite, a whole bunch of different stuff. We're going to try a lot of different things. So if you are interested, join the Patreon family today. Click the link in the description description box below and yeah enjoy the video all right peace that's the pop maze you on trial for the murder of murder what the, what the hell you talking about murder who the hell on now you better get it right <laughs> i ain't murdered nobody yet oh damn um <laughs> my bad wrong file <clears throat> <clears throat> where was i at the hell oh damn that's the pop maze, you are on trial for going 95 in a 30. First and foremost, do you swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? Mr. Judge, um, I'm a man of God, and I may be a lot of things. You know, people say I'm mean, angry, aggressive, violent. Some people say I'm handsome, <clears throat> a role model for the youth of today. But your highness, I can assure you, I it's your honor. Alright, whatever. I can assure you that I am no liar. If I say I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna do it. Eventually. Mr. Mays, what the heck do you swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? Yes or no? Yeah, uh. Mm hmm. Yup. Hell no! Not if the truth gonna get me locked up. I'm too pretty for jail. God damn it, I ain't going. By any means necessary. You can try to take me to jail if you want to. It's gonna be a fight to the death. We gonna be on the news. Who getting locked up today? Not me. Hell, if it's gonna keep me out of jail, I tell the lie, the whole lie, and nothing but the lie. And that's as the young kids say, on guard. <laughs> Mr. Mays, why were you speeding? Well, your majesty, see what happened was, I was on my way to feed the homeless after rescuing the cat from a tree. See, when I woke up late, because I was up all night knitting sweaters for kids in need. See, I was supposed to be in the soup kitchen by 9, but I woke up at 8.45. So as you can see, I was in a pinch. So I was in the car doing my Bible study, and I guess I was just so filled with the spirit, I didn't realize I was going that fast. <laughs> I'm so ashamed of myself. Your royalness, I am so sorry. Because, goddammit, I was late to work. You ever been late to work? See, when you show up late, they dock your pay. You missed the big money. My money little. I need all the money I can get. See, I woke up late because I was up all night watching Netflix. Now, I was supposed to be at work by 7. I woke up at 9.15. So as you can see, my money was decreasing. So I hopped off my ass, got in my vehicle, and I burned rubber. And that's why I'm here, missing a whole day of pay to come argue with your ass. Do you understand that by going that fast, you were putting other people's lives in danger? Mr. Judge, listen. Damn it, Mr. Mays, it's your honor. Yes, sir, I am honored to be here. Mr. Judge, yes, I do understand I put other people's lives in danger. And that's why I'm ashamed of my actions. As the deacon of my church, this is unacceptable. I will think about that day for the rest of my life. Mr. Judge, I pray that you would have mercy on me. I will never do anything like this again. You have my word. Bruh, bit off. Is you not listening? I was late. The hell with the people in danger? My job was in danger. My money was on the line. If I don't pay these bills, who gonna pay them? Not you. Exactly. Was anybody hurt? Was anybody hit? Did I run over anybody? Hell no. So the way I see it, I have done nothing wrong. Case dismissed. <laughs> Mr. Mage, do you have any final words before I reach my verdict? Yes, your excellence. I just want to say I deserve whatever punishment you decide. My behavior was completely unacceptable. I mean, come on, I was going 65 miles over the speed limit. Am I crazy? I'm talking about like life sentence. Lock me up and throw away the key. As a matter of fact, you need to revoke my license. I don't deserve it. My Sunday school kids in my church would be so disappointed with me. Mr. Judge, I am ready for your verdict. Yeah, I just want to say this some bullshit. I don't see what the problem is. You see, my question is, why was the officer hiding the bushes like that? Seems very suspect to me. You know something else? Not only was I docked for pay on that day, I'm missing a whole day of pay being here right now. Which means my check is gonna be short. So, the real question is, do you have any final questions before I hop that desk on your ass? Cause I believe you got me twisted, Mr. Judge. I tell you what, if I lose my job, it's gonna be me and you. So just be ready. I'm gonna roll your ass up like a burrito and then fold your ass like a lawn chair. Pass the pop maze, I sentence you to 10 years in prison. No! Give me 15 to 20, Judge. I deserve it. I will sit in my jail cell and reflect on the horrible decision that I made. And I guarantee I'll be a better man when I get out at 75 years old. 10 years! Alright, Mr. Maze, look like you coming with me. Hell no! Yeah.